Now at 623, it's not just the average Joe out there posting workouts to social media while we isolate ourselves. Pro athletes are doing it too. And it's not just to stay healthy, but because it's literally their job. CBS4 sports anchor Mike Cuno shows us how one Dolphins player is pedaling his way towards training camp. Buns out, buns out, baby. Get those squats in. While we all continue to adjust to social distancing, some of our favorite athletes are posting their in-home workouts online. From Heat All-Star Jimmy Butler showing us different stretching routines, to Panther Center Alexander Barkov shooting toilet paper rolls. Their seasons are on hold, but football players usually take this time of year to get ready for training camp. Dolphin safety Adrian Colbert is confined to his high-rise apartment with a small makeshift gym on his balcony that includes some weights, a medicine ball, and most importantly for him, his Peloton bike. This is my way of social distancing and staying active. He says Dolphin trainers have sent them more workouts than usual because their weight rooms and fields are closed down, so these guys have to get creative. I feel like I'm back in high school because I remember in high, the high school days, like the workouts weren't as uh, complex now. I'm going back to drills I used to do back in the day and it, it's fun and it, it puts you in that like that from the ground up type mentality. Colbert got the idea about jumping on a home bike from his former teammate and five time pro bowler Richard Sherman. I remember Sherm doing cardio on the bike a lot last year so I was like man he just bought out and he like wanted to go so I mean I might as well start implementing this to my to my regiment. While Colbert rides from his apartment he can see the stadium he's called home since his University of Miami days. The stadium man I see I see opportunity opportunity man just to just to be great. Over the last 30 days, Colbert has burned close to 7,000 calories alone on his balcony. But he's not the only one. He'll video chat with friends during his rides and post them on social media, connecting to the outside world while preparing for the season, if there is one, as best he can. Make sure to incorporate your Boy, and your five-minute Also, Mike Cuno, CBS4 This Morning.